What is up guys, welcome back to the channel and today we have a pretty special video. We're gonna be unboxing 10, yes, 10 amiibo card packs. Uh, as you guys may or may not know, Nintendo re-released these and they seem to be selling out everywhere. If you haven't got any yet, there are still a few sites. Uh, what I'm gonna do for you guys, I'm gonna link them in the description. We got Best Buy, GameStop, Amazon. If they are sold out, they are slowly coming back into stock. Um, luckily I was able to get this. I actually ordered 15, but we're going to be unboxing 10 today. So I'm very excited on, uh, what we're going to get. I've done unboxings of Amiibos before, but they've always been like crazy expensive. Uh, if you guys want to know, these go for $5.99, uh, not too bad. And these come with, I believe five cards and there's different villagers within each series. So we have series two, series three, and series four. And there are some pretty good villagers in each. So as I'm opening them, I'll kind of tell you guys who I'm going after and uh, we'll see who we'll get. So I guess uh, let's get started. All right guys, so we are starting off with series two and I actually have three packs of those. And uh, this is gonna kind of be like villager hunting. There are a few that I want. And like I said before, there are exclusive villagers and NPCs in each of these series. For So for series two, uh, the two NPCs I really want is Kix and Jack. And then as far as villagers go, uh, Whitney, Bo, Ruby, Julian, and Anka. So we're going to be doing a little bit of villager hunting today. So here we go. The coveted Animal Crossing amiibo cards. Here we go. All right. So after you bend them and ruin all their value. Okay, let's go here. Let's start with the NPC. It's like the least exciting of the group. Okay, so here we go. Is this Jack? Is this Kix? It is... Okay. We got LaBelle, not too bad, she's pretty cute. All right, now to the villagers. We have Alice, okay, she's pretty cute. Uh, Nan, some uh, some different ones here, I like it. Uh, Wendy, okay, a little watermelon sheep g going on there. We got Blair, used to have her on my island. And then we have Lucha, which uh, unpopular opinion, I think he's my favorite bird. So solid pack, solid pack. All right, let's go to the second one in series two uh to me personally i really like series three i think series three might be the better overall collection okay so here we go start with the npc once again do we got jack my baby jack okay isabel all right that's a double here and let's go series two bring me some luck Hanfrey, you piece of garbage <laughs> okay we got Hanfrey. definitely not a looker but uh he's all right we got Drake, Filbert, nice. That's a really good pick. I like him quite a bit. Very unique color, has a pretty cute house. Cookie, guys, I didn't mention her in the uh, the ones I was looking for, but she's definitely good. Nice pack so far. Uh, it was a nice pack. No, uh, Pate, okay, not too bad. I mean, we started off with a stinker here, but I gotta say, Filbert and Cookie, those are some pretty good ones. All right, now let's go to the third pack. Oh, this is so addicting. Guys, control yourselves with these purchases. All right, so this is the third pack in the second series. Here we go. Let's see who the NPC is. I really want Jack, like, come on, man. Okay, we got Layla, not too bad. Let's go to the villagers here and Freya. Okay, another one of those like underrated villagers. Really good pick here. We have Bettina. I don't think I've seen you before. Um, Timbra, okay. Definitely getting some sheep love. Uh, Broccolo, again, it would be very, very cute without that hair piece. That's all right though. And then we have Vladimir. So, uh, okay pack. We started strong with Freya. Let me know what you think about Timbra. Timbra's a little sass on her. Okay, so that was series two. Okay, next we have series three. Uh, I have three of these packs and uh, let me tell you some of the ones I'm looking for. Uh, as far as the NPCs, we have Leaf, Franklin, and Jingle. We're also coming up in that update. Um, the villagers that are really good in this one, we have Marina, Marshall is the big, uh, big ticket item in this one. Maple, Francine, and Chrissy. So uh, those are the ones we're looking for. Again, there's some other good like uh, underrated ones in this series, but let's get going. Series three, I love this uh, blue color we got here. Ooh, that was a clean unboxing, look at that. Okay, here we go. 
the NPC. Let's see our boy Leaf. Ooh, we got Phyllis. I miss Phyllis. Okay, let's go to the villagers now. And we start with my boy Chatter. Wow, this is a new Leaf throwback. We got Chatter here. Uh, we got Pippi. Okay, another one of those sort of underrated villagers. Next we have Chester. Eloise. And we got a goat. Who could this be? Who could this be? We have Velma. All right. Um, pretty weak pack. Not gonna, okay. Pretty weak pack. Let's go to the next one. And clean rips on this. Okay. I would really love Jingle, especially Christmas time coming up. That's the boy we want. Let's see. Rover. Nice. Okay. I will take that. Rover's cool. I hope he comes back. And uh, let's see what we got for the villagers. Starting with Antonio. One of the few doubles, by the way. I've, I've opened like a bunch of these packs now. Antonio is one of my few doubles. Next up, we have Dora. Pretty cute. Not too bad. Blanche. Definitely underrated, guys. If you're looking for a good winter villager, I would say uh, pick her. Next, we have Chevry. Okay. And I'm excited because there's a cat there. See that little cat symbol? Uh, Chevry is not too bad. And then we have Mitzi. Mitzi's pretty good. I like Mitzi quite a bit. All right. Solid pack. Started strong with Rover. Let's go to the final pack in series three. Again, I would love Jingle. We struck out with Jack, but can we get Jingle? Let's, let's, uh, harness some of that Christmas energy. Here we go. Digby. Not too bad. All right. We got to I'm not as excited. I like Digby, but it's a double for me. So not too bad. Um, here we go with the villagers. Turning really quick. Who do you think it is? Oh, guys. Let's go. Francine was one of the ones I was looking for. I think an underrated winter villager. I've always said like the ears kind of look like a little hoodie that she's wearing. Okay. I'm very happy about this one. We actually got someone that's on the list. So that's awesome. Next we have Barbara. Okay, you got to respect the pun in the name. Uh, not my favorite, though. We have Hamlet. Okay, one of my starting villagers in my uh, my main island. Definitely have a soft spot for Hamlet. Next up, we have Ricky. So this is going to go in the paper shredder. Not too bad. Oh, God. You're, yeah. And then we have Dell. Okay, little robot boy. Um, I had him on my island before, and he lives up to being cranky. He was... Not a joy at all, but we did get Francine. So that's, that's a win right there. Honestly, in Hamlet too. Okay. I'm pretty, uh, pretty happy with that pack actually. Okay. Next up is series four and this is a good series. Okay. And I have four packs. Okay. So this is the, the most that I have any of these series today. Um, the NPCs, we have more good ones. Okay. I'm looking for Brewster, my boy, who isn't looking for Brewster, honestly. Uh, we also have Red and Zipper T. So those are some pretty good ones. I really want all the holiday NPCs. I think that'd be really cute. Um, as far as villagers, this might be the most important one, okay? We have Shep, who's my birthday twin. November 24th, SAG gang, where you at? We have Lolly, little uh, snowy kitty. My boy, Eric, okay? Eric could be lost in these packs somewhere. We have Zucker and Ribot. Ribot is the one I really want, okay? So let's start with this first one. Series four is very, very solid. The only series that I haven't got yet is series one, which has really, really good ones in it. Okay, here we go. Not as clean, not as clean of a rip as the other ones. Okay, do we have Brewster? Do we have Red or do we have Creepy Little Zipper? Here we go. Dr. Shrunk, okay. Definitely underrated, I love Shrunk, man. Shrunk, we have we have an emotion wheel now. We don't really need you anymore. Uh, R.I.P. Not forgotten. Okay. In terms of villagers, here we go with series four. Nibbles. All right. You got a lot of underrated villagers. I like it. Next up is Poppy. Half zebra, half horse. Not too bad. Uh, we got Waltz. Little uh, old samurai type guy. You got to love it. Next, we have Pinky. I can't tell, guys. Pinky, is she cute? Is she not? We have a dog ending things out. Bones, all right. Now I wanna go to Target. Look at this guy. Bones is kinda cute, I like him. So not a bad pack. Not a bad pack to start it off. We still have three more. So like, 
Eric? Baby boy, you out there. All right, here we go. Let's open this up. That was terrible. All right, let's go for the NPC. Again, my boy Brewster. Zipper, red even, I'll take him. Here we go, Zipper! Look at that! Oh my God, lots of hate for Zipper, especially in New Horizons, but that is one of the holiday ones down, so that makes me very excited. That's worth it for this pack, honestly. First one, we have Rowan. Okay, little Frosted Flakes knockoff, you gotta love it. Uh, Hippo, this is not getting better. This is not getting better at all. Uh, we got Static. Guys, that is a good cranky villager. Stat oh, Static's kind of cool. Look at him. Nice color on there. Uh, Penelope. I could see the fandom growing for Penelope. Definitely cute. And then a cat to end it off. Who do we have here? We have cats. Okay, probably the worst cat in the bunch. Did I just offend a bunch of people? Cats, okay. This pack, I mean, you gotta, you gotta think Zipper was in here. Uh, Static? That's, that's the only good one in that one. But uh, I definitely like Static. Here we go with the third one. Eric is still lost. Shep is still lost. Can we get them? I don't know, but we got Zipper. We conjured Zipper up. Okay, here we go. So we are also looking, we're only looking for Red and Brewster now. Those are the dreamies as far as the NPCs. Here we go with Resetti. Okay. Man, Animal Crossing is not the same without Rossetti. That's okay, though. Terms of the villagers, here we go with Kevin. He's okay. He, he doesn't look too bad in this picture. Uh, next one is Rizzo. He looks bad in this picture. Oof. Not too good. We got uh, Apple. Wow, I know a lot of people like Apple. So that's, that's pretty good. I'll take that. Next up, we have Mira. Little superhero. I like the attitude, look at that. And then we have Annabelle, which I actually like quite a bit. So Annabelle's not too bad. Definitely reminds me of uh, Sandshrew. Anyone else get that vibe? Uh, Annabelle's quite good. This is a good pack. Look at that, Apple, Mira. All right guys, here we go. Last chance to get Eric. Last chance to get Ribot. We didn't get anyone we wanted so far. I mean, decent ones, decent ones, don't get me wrong. All right. Let's open these up, these bad boys here. If this is Brewster, Brewster's gonna come out in the next update. Here we go, Isabel, all right. Thank you for crushing my dreams, Isabel. All right, that's all right, that's all right. And the first villager is Gale, okay. Definitely one of the better alligators, right? Pretty good pink color, I like it. Uh, next up is Jocks or Jakes, what do you guys say? Little, uh, gotta love an animal with some uh, facial hair, right? Ribot, guys, we did it! Okay, this is a good. This is good. Even if we don't get Eric, we got my boy Ribot. Super underrated, very unique character design. His house is cool too. Ribot, definitely the winner here. We got Dottie. Okay, another underrated villager. Look at Dottie. A little bit plain, but uh, spruce her up with some different uh, clothes, not too bad. And then we have Pashmina. She actually looks really good here. Pashmina, a little cottagecore goat walking around. Okay, this is a decent pack. These last three. <laughs> I'm so happy we got Ribot. So uh, overall, I would say pretty big success. Let's go over some of my favorites. All right, so let's go over some of the favorites. Obviously we got Ribot in here, um, Francine, Look at these. So we got two that we were hunting for, essentially. Um, some of the other ones, Hamlet's not too bad. And uh, there was a couple more. Mitzi is very good. Underrated cat right there. Chatter, if you're going for a mouse, you know, if you have a craving for cheese, that wouldn't be too bad. And then, uh, oh yeah, we got Zipper T. I don't know if I passed him. Filbert and Cookie. This was probably the best pack overall. Those are two great ones. Uh, going down the line more. We got some good NPCs. We got a couple Isabels. Blair is solid. You gotta love Blair. Lucha, interesting. I could see him fitting uh, some themes out there. Freya, underrated right there. And uh, yeah, that's about it. 
The rest can go in the trash. I'm kidding. No. Uh, some pretty good ones here, guys. Let me know what you think. All right, guys. So there you go. Those are the, uh, that was the unboxing. Let me know uh, if any of your favorites were in any of the packs that we opened up in the comment section below. Let me know also if you would like me to do more of these unboxings. I know Amiibo cards sometimes are kind of hard to find. Sometimes they're a bit easier. So I'll do my best. Uh, definitely smash that like button and think about subscribing, guys. And I will see you in the very next video. Have a good one.